Hey guys, welcome back to the Matt and Summer YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Tom and Jazz is filming. We tour luxury properties across the UK and today we are in Royal Arsenal Riverside where we're going to be showing you around this Berkeley development and into an £842,000 show home. This development is great for commuters with the new Crossrail link right on site. It can get you to Canary Wharf in just eight minutes or Tottenham Court Road in 20 minutes. We've also got the new Elizabeth line. Jazz and I actually took that this morning from Euston to Woolwich station, which again is right on site, so super convenient. And yeah, it's just great to have that right on your doorstep. It's a very special site here, rich in history, dating back to King Henry VIII. We've also got cannons dotted around, very fitting with the Arsenal theme. Some incredible amenities here too, and this space is incredible. So we're gonna be showing you all of that after the tour. But for now, let's head up to the apartment and get going. You ready? Let's do it. All right, guys, so we're inside the apartment now, just in this entrance hall. It's quite a big space, actually, isn't mm. it, Jess? Yeah, I'm quite surprised. Quite wide hallways, which I was surprised with. And we've got a really big feature mirror, big circular room. Oh, we love our circle mirrors. Exactly that, and then we've got these unique coat hangers. Which yeah, cool. I like them. <laughs> little touch, isn't it? We've got hardwood flooring with the chevron patterns. Nice. Very luxury. Mm -hmm. And then in here, we've got a utility room, which could double up as sort of a boot room, cloak room. It's got a lot of space. Yes, huge. I was very surprised by how yeah, big that so is that in there. Work well. We've also got loads of paintings and artwork I'm seeing initially, which is nice. Yeah. Done a good job of interior design in here with all the shelves and the decorations. It looks great. Yeah. We've also got storage there as well. Yeah. So we've got some storage here behind this dining space. Nice open area so you can eat your meals. A good entertaining area as yeah, well inside here. Yeah, sure. We've got the kitchen coming up as well. So like I say, with a good entertaining space, we've got a wine fridge here alongside all of these nice kitchen fittings. We've got Siemens appliances all the way through the kitchen. So the hob, the microwave oven, <laughs> and the oven. It's all Siemens, so it all stays the same. No mix and match. Yes. We've got the under lighting underneath the cupboards. Yeah. And then this composite quartz countertop that goes up the wall as well, the splashback. Yeah, it looks really nice, the contrast. I was the just dark. about to say. It's classic, isn't it? The we love a black kitchen. And the white, it's very timeless. Looks lovely. But actually, it's worth noting here, we've got some artwork from artists that are local to this apartment, to yeah. this um, development. They're very big on community here, yeah. so it's nice to see that in the show home, they have added these little quirky exactly, bits. Yeah, so we've got some like, local pottery, Makers, we've got artists, we've actually got Pottery John on oh, yeah. the other side as well, we like with pottery ceramic John. pots, which look really good, adding to that Mediterranean theme. So, as we come into the lounge now, you'll see that with the sort of the wicker chair with the cupboards underneath the TV. Really cozy in here, they've separated yeah. it because it's got this rug which sort of on your feet now, I haven't got my shoes on, and my mm. toes can feel the softness of this little rug, and it really makes it more cozy in the lounge space when you've got hardwood flooring. It's for sure, it's really snug. Isn't exactly. It? And then and with that Mediterranean theme, I always think these like really thin shades. Yeah, like the sheer curtains. Adds to that feel, especially when the, the, uh, the doors are open and they're sort of blowing in. Blowing <laughs> yeah. In. Exactly. We will show you that balcony, but Jazz is going to show you that in a little yeah. bit. Yeah. So, Shall we show you the bedroom? Yeah, let's do let's it. Swap over then and I'll give you that. this. So we're going to come through into bedroom one, the principal bedroom, around here. But before we do that, I'm just going to give you a little look at the family slash guest bathroom. Love the sand neutral tones in here. We've got yeah. this nice textured wall here along with the marble tiling there. Yeah, so there's like the two different tiles. One's yeah. matte, one's shiny, which yeah, is nice. Yeah, it's a good contrast and it's the same on the floor. You can feel it. Yeah, texture. less slippery. Yeah, oh yeah, it's good. And then we also have a lot of mirror storage. Very, yeah, very deep, deep. shelves. We've got those well. niches in there where the sink is, but then also in the shower for your product. Yeah. I love that they put plants in there yeah. as well. It looks really luxury, I think. Yes, it does sure. make it look better. The tones work really well with the plants in here. There's yeah, a lot of do. greenery around the apartment. And even the doors, like the big yeah. black frame doors, yeah. they just look stunning. Yeah, it's good colours. Pinterest vibes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> right, now coming into bedroom one such a nice space and the carpet's really plush yeah 
We've got these gorgeous dual aspect windows. This one has a nice desk so you can do your work looking out onto the Thames, which is really nice, and also Canary Wharf down there. Yeah. We've got this gorgeous double bed. Again with that wicker theme. Yes. It's really Mediterranean. I think it the is. tone of the wall as well, where Definitely, they've got like, like the tones. Yeah, the sort of sand earth colour. Yeah, very nice. And sticking with the artistic theme. Yes. Now behind Tom we also have a lot of inbuilt storage space. Let me just come around and show you guys. So I'll show you this one. We've got the rails in here. Yeah, yeah, open it both up. Oh yeah, okay. Make sure the other one as well. And then the shelving and there really deep setbacks so you can put so much in there if you like me and you have a lot of clothes you'll be absolutely yeah. fine here <laughs> yeah and i love the fact that they've got all these little shelves just dotted around yeah yeah it's nice this one being the principal bedroom has the ensuite once again sticking to the same theme of the family bathroom yeah really nice neutral tone this one with the bath though so a little bit more luxury oh, gotta yeah. have a bath in here yeah another good thing to point out is the fact that we have uh, an attached shower head and then a detachable one. Yes. We've got two, which is yeah. quite good with apartments. It's got like a handheld houses. jet, but then yeah. also that rainfall shower yeah. above. Exactly. Very nice and luxury. Now, I'm going to take you to bedroom two. I think personally, this one is my favourite. Yeah. Purely because. The green, right? The colour scheme. I thought it, so. Oh, it looks so good. I am a big fan of the green. We've got the nice split wall. It just looks. Yeah, oh, it does look lovely, and it really works with the plants as well. Definitely. There. And pillows, and we're sticking yeah. with the wooden theme. We've got a nice rail there as well, and we have this gorgeous, once again, dual aspect with the blackout curtains that go all the way around. We've also got a lot of nice artwork in here. I'm a fan of the one next to you, Tom. It's huge. It's probably bigger than me. Very yeah. simplistic art. Yeah, it's once cool. Once again, Pinterest vibes. Like yes, said. exactly. Now I'm going to take you out onto the balcony, what you've all been waiting for. Nice. Definitely one of the like selling points. Yes, the view, the outdoor space, but also having the view as well, exactly. which you guys will see in just a second. Big sliding doors. Yeah. All the lighting. Wow. It's so amazing to have a property literally on the like Yeah, on the Thames. Bank of the Thames. <laughs> yeah. And you've got the view that way, you can see the into the river, and then we've also got the view of Canary Wharf up there. Yeah. So much to see. And down here it's worth noting, we actually have a grade listed I think it was a steamboat like kind of pier to yeah, people to exactly get that. on and off. And it's really nice to just have that bit of history. Really rich bit of history. Yeah. This right development there. has a lot of history there. It dates does. back to Henry the Eighth. In the, yeah, so yeah, it's, it's awesome. Loads and loads of history here. We've also got seating areas on this balcony. I like them, they look like little mushrooms. Yeah, they do, don't they? Yeah, and we've got nice little spotlights integrated into the ground as well, and these glass balustrades. balustrades. That's so the one. We've just got the full aspect out. Yeah, another thing as well, which you don't normally see, is we've got these like lantern shaped balconies yeah. so they're not square mm. they're sort of cut off the edge which is good because it gives you a bit of a better view up the river around, rather than yeah. cutting a, one side of the view off definitely and another thing to note is that we ha actually have london city airport right there yeah we've been watching planes away. take off and land <laughs> yeah it's really interesting isn't it so yeah if it is. you're a plane watcher yeah yeah <laughs> yeah just cop yourself a house <laughs> <laughs> right so now we are going to go show you around some more of the site. We've got so much to show you. We've got the commute, the amenities, sorry, all the different. Yeah, we're gonna go to the waterside club, aren't we? Yeah, we're excited we're to gonna, do that. Yeah, check out the swimming pool, gyms, loads of amenities here. And it's all on this one, it feels like a village, but it it's does, all on this yeah. one development. So yeah, it's a lot here and we're gonna go and check it out. Let's go. We're now in Maribel Park, one of the site's nice green space, and there's such an abundance of it. And it's really good because the site is dog friendly as well as the apartments. So they've got all this massive amount of green space to roam around, and it's great in the summer. And it's also great to have all of this in the middle of London. All right, guys, we've just stopped for a bite to eat. We are at one of 
The two pubs on site called the Dial Arch is absolutely lovely. I've got myself a Culture Club pizza. You can see that is massive. Nice, yeah, looks good, good. Good portion size. And Tom's got his oh. fish and chips. Yeah. He's keeping it, you know, traditionally British on the Jubilee, Jubilee weekend. weekend. Yeah. So it's, yeah, it's a really nice place. We've got some cool inside seating areas as well yes. and some outside space. Massive, isn't yeah. it? We're looking forward to trying it out. So get a scrand, scrand. <laughs> And once you've had a bite to eat, you can head down to the fitness suite. We've got the gym here with loads and loads of equipment. And so, yeah, I'm going to uh, burn some calories after that lunch, I think. And then after the gym, we have this 20 meter swimming pool. You can enjoy a dip in along with a sauna, steam room and a jacuzzi. And I think me and Tom are going to head in for a dip now. All right, guys, so we finished up in the leisure facilities that are just to my left there. And now we're going to take you onto the Thames Clipper so you can get an idea of what it's like to live here as well. Alright guys, so we just got off the Thames Clipper at Embankment and we are now just next to the London Eyes, you can see. The journey down here on the boat was full of gorgeous, iconic London landmarks, so I'm sure you guys would love that. Now we hope you've enjoyed the video. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe and also to follow our Instagram at Matt and Summer Official for more exclusive behind the scenes content. Now we're going to leave Berkeley's details in the description below, so make sure to check them out and we'll see you in the next video.